So wait, may I go send up me in the video? Mm-hmm. And you just want to email by so. Mm hmm candle here. I do what? So I say mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back to Uncloud Lindsay. So as you know, Uncloud Lindsay is expecting Baby Lindsay. Baby Lindsay. <laughs> <laughs> we are expecting our first baby. So in getting ready and preparing for um, a newborn, we have decided to create a gift registry on using Amazon. Um, mainly because I was not planning on having a baby shower mm -hmm. because, you know, with all the restrictions and things like that, we were not planning to have a baby shower. But we wanted to give all of our family and friends the opportunity to shop nice or shop something for um, baby Lindsay. So what do we have? So we're going to go through our Amazon registry and just kind of share some of the things on the list with you now we haven't put everything on the list mainly because i got excited my mom has gotten excited he's gotten excited <laughs> we have just bought a lot of things um that probably should have been put on the registry but um was bought before the registry was mm -hmm. even made so, so on the registry the items have been categorized mm -hmm. and we're going to go through it according to the categories so in clothing the first thing is uh we have the simple joys by carter they're like these cute little i guess pajama onesies they are long sleeve and they're footed mm -hmm. so we have that and because baby Lindsay is going to be a summer baby we didn't want to get a lot of long sleeve things so we got um a bunch of the also short sleeve um short mm -hmm. short um are they onesies also? I don't know what to call these. <laughs> <laughs> the little short sleeve one. So we put a few of those on the list as well. Mm -hmm. Then in the next category is bathing and skincare. Is this for the baby or is it for you? No, this is for baby. So mm -hmm. in uh, bathing and skincare, um, I chose a brand and I wanted to stick, kind of stick to that brand. So we're using kind of the Aveeno brand because I've had lots of recommendations. People say that Aveeno is good um, for moisturizing the baby's skin. I guess for texting against eczema or if the baby has eczema. Do babies like automatically have eczema? Is that a thing? I wouldn't know. I don't know. So because people say to buy eczema stuff. So, so, so I feel like my baby's going to have eczema like right out the womb. So we have lots of Aveeno conditioner, shampoo, Only two. body wash. No, there's, there's more. All right. The next one is... And okay. So I found this Angel Care Baby Bath Support. Um, I think that... It is a, um, it's not a bathtub, but it's something that you put into your bathtub. Like you have the big bathtub at home. So this goes into the big bathtub for when you're bathing the baby. I'm still trying to figure out what this thing is. It looks <laughs> like a clothes iron. It's and, bigger. Uh, no, <laughs> in the, pic the picture is small. So obviously that's what it looks like, but it'll be bigger. Okay, we'll see. Well, you'll take a look at it and you can give me um, your feedback on it if, you, if you've if you tried this or um, if you would like to try it. I'll definitely, when I do get it and see what it looks like, I'll definitely do a review on it okay. so that we know if, it's, um, if it works or not. Okay, so the next section is for bedding. And we have these amazing baby swaddle blankets with adjustable, adjustable what? <laughs> you gotta touch this part. <laughs> adjustable wrap. So these are swaddles. Again, I've heard 
that the baby that you should swaddle the baby <laughs> and <laughs> we're just going based on what things we heard <laughs> so so these are um they're little swaddle i guess not blankets but they're pre-made swaddle blankets so instead of using the blanket itself and actually putting the baby in the blanket and folding it and wrapping it and tucking it and things like that <laughs> you can just slip the baby into the swaddle wrap and just kind of snap it shut okay and then we have some what are these blankets? so these are blankets so i think one's a receiving blanket and one's a feeding blanket a burp burp cloth oh yeah yeah i think that's <laughs> what it is mm -hmm. okay then for diapering so what's this under the diapering so he doesn't know anything <laughs> doesn't know anything about a baby I know enough, but I don't, need, I, I don't need to know all these things. So, again, um, under the diapering section, mm -hmm. we have we chose to go with the Burt's Bees Baby Diaper Rash Ointment. Um, again, I don't know if that's a, the good, a good brand for the baby, but I've used Burt's Bees before, and I know that, personally, I liked it. Um, even though but you're not a baby, baby skin. Uh, well, is, this, well, this is for babies. So this is for babies. So the adult section, the adult birth um, product that they make mm -hmm. was really good for me. I liked it. Then we have diapers. Now for the <coughs> diapers, I I was going back and forth contemplating what to get, which diapers to use because I feel like everybody every time I I try to choose a diaper. Somebody else would say something about it, that diaper brand. And I was just like, oh, man. So um, I decided to go with, I decided to try the Pampers Pure. I think it's for sensitive skin. So I'm trying that one. That's on the list. I didn't get a lot of them because again, I'm just trying them out. So if within the first couple of weeks, we i feel like they're not doing what they're supposed to do or they're not doing it 100 percent. i'll definitely check out a different brand so for now we've got the diapers in new two different sizes because i'm not sure how big the baby is going to be because <laughs> <laughs> so far he's a very big baby <laughs> so far he's big <laughs> then we have just a couple of things into the feeding section. My mom got excited and she got stuff. So she did buy bottles, <laughs> even though I'm breastfeeding because she wants to be able to feed too, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so because she got some bottles, I, I got some pump and go breast milk storage bags. So I just have a couple packs of those, a couple sets of those. I also saw in here, um, actually I think these, some of these were also recommended by um, someone who also just recently had a baby. So um, we got like uh, pacifier and bottle wipes, some bottle brushes and um, different things like that. And now in the gear section, only one item? Mm -hmm. And it's already purchased? <laughs> yes. Okay, so it's the Fresh Prince font. Stop it. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's the Fisher Price Fawn Meadows Deluxe Bouncer, and I think it's portable. It should be a portable bouncer. Um, so I was kind of on the fence about putting this on the on our registry, mainly because I was thinking to myself, um, "Are we going to use it?" And then I was like, "Yeah, you're probably definitely going to need to put the baby down at some point, mm. <laughs> especially with the baby. You're probably going to need your hands to do something." <laughs> A bunch of these items were recommend was recommended by our awesome friend uh, Tamisha. She just had a baby. Go check out her channel. Her baby's so cute. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> so we have the Oogie Bear uh, Curve Loop and Scoop uh, Booger Remover, or Snot. No, this one's the Booger Remover, and then the mm -hmm. Snot Sucker and Frida by Frida Baby. And also, this one is a 
a cradle cap system. Um, I think this is cute. I put this on here because it looks like something useful. To do what? It's for like rubbing the baby's head. When you're washing it? Yeah. You're so short. <laughs> <laughs> it's a sponge brush comb and comb, yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's for like combing the baby's hair, brushing the baby's hair, and just, yeah, that's what it is. I'm sure of what it is. So it's a baby hair brush? It's a hairbrush and comb type of um, set. Okay, and what's this down here? So then that down here, this one is in the other in the other section. Um, it's about just about the end of the list. Mm -hmm. We got the Munchkin Arm and Hammer diaper bag. Um, there they are bags for putting your di dirty diapers in. So um, we didn't get a we didn't get a a diaper bin for for Toronto because um, we bought one here. So we're just gonna keep that one here. And then I got these bags because I think that we could use these ones um, in Toronto and just leave the diaper bin here. We didn't wanna lug it back and forth with us or get one in Toronto and then have to lug it here with us. So also on the list, um, now this one, um, it's very important. Um, it's very important, but I'm not. I don't know how sure I am about it. Um, I did do my research, and I did research, look it up on YouTube, and it seems to be quite popular. Versus another brand that I saw. So this is the Outlet Cam Smart Baby Monitor. So I guess it's a. It's so. It's a. A baby monitor, I said that. <laughs> but it has like the little camera and it's, I think it has also um, the smart socks. Mm -hmm. The smart socks so that it can, it can keep, you can kind of monitor the baby's heart rate and oxygen levels. Mm -hmm. So um, I thought this was a good idea. Um, to a good, a good um, cam. Um, um, um. I thought this was a good baby monitor to have. And then the last few things on the list are just uh, the baby hat, some mitts, the uh, bassinet sheet. Definitely got a bassinet sheet. I did get a bassinet um, for here and also for one for um, Toronto. Check out our next video. We're going to be unboxing the bassinet that we got here. So you can definitely see it in this video. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where it'll come up. Um, burp cloths, the changing pad, got a changing pad and the changing pad liners, along with a diaper caddy organizer. I think this would be a good idea to have, especially next to your bed so you don't have to like struggle around to find your wipes and diapers and things like that in the middle of the night for a change and the baby wipe warmer the bella baby wipe warmer again something else something that was also um recommended to me so i'm going to definitely try it out and then just again Wait, so we have the lotion here yeah the baby <laughs> lotion and the eczema cream why are they at the top? I'm not quite sure. Um, then, one of the other things that I put on here is a Boppy Comfy Fit Hybrid Baby Carrier. So, this looks like one of the wrap carriers that are, that you tie up. And I was like, oh, this is cute. Like, I think this will definitely, something to carry the baby in and... What, is it easy to wrap? Um, it should be easy to wrap. I think... I think once I know how to wrap it, once we know how to wrap it, then it should be easy to go. I like that. Okay. Also, well, <laughs> <laughs> we also have um, a couple mesh laundry bags that we put in there just to for when we're doing the baby's laundry, um, so that we can have them kind of separated. Um, 
fit we got face wipes some all-purpose wipes baby bibs muslin bath towels and washcloths more baby mittens <laughs> um baby powder and oh um that's about it the last two items we have i got some baby black and white flashcards. um i was told that they would be good to help develop the baby's vision um the um baby's cognitive development <laughs> so we got some of those <laughs> And the last thing that is on our list. Oh, that one's already purchased? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, nice. <laughs> the Fisher Prize Rainforest Music and Light Deluxe. Deluxe one. Deluxe gym. gym. <laughs> Sorry. So it comes, it has like a whole lot of colors and little animals on there. Things that the baby can play with um, when they're, it's like a little mat. So the baby will lay on the mat and play with it. And it also does good tummy time. So that's just some of the things that we have on the our baby registry. Uh, we're gonna put the link down below so that you can take a look at it. If you are um, expecting a baby, you can check out our registry and see mm -hmm. if you if you find any of the things useful. Please also comment and let us know if there's anything I need to add to the registry. Any important, or any thing important that things forgot. that we have forgot to put on there. Um, let us know and like i said though some of the things the things that are on there are things that i feel will be necessary for the first three months at least mm -hmm. because after that we'll be coming back to the uae and we didn't want to get those big items where we have to worry about how they're going to come back with us and later on when we come back we will get those things um while we are here so comment below, let us know. Also, if you want to check out our registry and buy us something off of there, go ahead. <laughs> we won't stop you. <laughs> so that's it for Baby Lindsay's registry. We are so excited for our first little baby, our first little boy. We are super excited for you guys to meet him. We can't wait. <laughs> As you would have seen by now, I'm here really for support. <laughs> <laughs> but thanks for tuning in and remember to like share and subscribe and leave a comment down below and see you next, next time, time on cloud, cloud